he joined and he saved the team really and he's a really ambitious player so good luck Tom in your future at your, your new team and I know one day you will you may be back you you know always a mate good mate to us um, but yeah new challenges away next season we've got two new players but guys I won I won at life I have a trophy to prove it Yeah, but no legs, no problem is more comical than what we. Ah, that's fine. Fuck it. That's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Fuck it. There you go. There's your answer. Generation of creators in this platform this makes me feel are people good. who right now have less than a yeah. thousand subs. Um, that's where it starts. But okay, I would like to thank the academy, my mum, my dad, everyone involved in the making of this movie. I thank you for this Oscar, but this Oscar is really not an Oscar. <laughs> Very nice words, but happens to be wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. <laughs> Alright guys, look at this man. Welcome to another vlog, and I have a trophy that I really earn, I think, and well deserved, I think. Manager's Player of the Year uh, for this whole season. Patch of football, another great season. Um, and yeah, this is what I've got to show for it, a huge trophy. It, it does feel like an Oscar, it weighs about that. Um, well, I can't lift it, that's for sure. Um, but nice no, good luck winning the World Cup, you know what I mean? It looks more like a World Cup trophy. Um, but yeah, credit to the whole team. Everyone deserves one of these, really, because everyone's put in the effort, as because we were a team, you know? Teamwork. But um, So yeah, welcome to another vlog. Um, all about this really, it's not really a vlog is it? Um, but I hope you enjoyed my last vlog where it was just a pure GoPro um, point of view video just something different that like I thought I'd do that for a change this is me yapping on about some BS all the time um, but yeah this is um, voted, I was basically what I'm trying to say is this trophy um, all the like coaching staff voted for, voted for this, the managers player you got the players player who was uh, one of my good teammates Reese. Um, and Jack got the um, top goal scorer, credit to Jack as well. I think 17 or 18 goals. Um, but yeah, this is, this is a big trophy. Um, and I've had the managers play a trophy in the past. Um, like 2008, I think. Still got that trophy, but yeah, this is quality. This is great. Um, and it just pr goes to show that it doesn't matter what team you're in, you can still shine and be the best player possible, if not more. I'm feeling more of a player than I was in my former team because I'm playing more, really part of the team. And this is what goes to show. This goes to show what what happens when you're in a good team and you, you feel happy with you know your your opportunities on the pitch. But it goes for life as well. I take it like in general for whatever you're doing. You know, um, you don't always get a trophy for what you do in life, do you? You don't you get a medal. You know, unless you're in like the Olympics, but um, you don't really get trophies like this, you know, so many people that deserve more than just a trophy, like, for what they do, like, on a day-to-day -day basis, for other people, really, and, yeah, so this is what I got, it's like winning an Oscar, kind of, um, but yeah, I didn't, I, you know, I didn't expect, I don't know, you never, you, you, you can't expect to get this sort of trophy, but I, I didn't, and then, so it was nice. I'm not saying I was surprised, because I've worked hard and we all have this season. Um, but you can't give out one of these to everyone, can you? Um, you've got to pick one for each thing. And here we go, this is my reward. Um, yeah, it's a shame. I, I wanted to do this vlog outside. Um, like I normally do. I mean, if, you're, if you've been here a while, you'll know that I, I do prefer outside than inside. I hate doing vlogs in here. Um, we haven't had much of a summer yet. I did a vlog about the first day of summer the other day. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do another podcast soon, more live streams coming soon, um, if you're new here, thank you for joining, good evening, good day, good night, whatever time of day you're watching this, um, thank you, I don't, I don't know what else I'm going to do in this vlog to be honest, um, no creative ideas flowing today, 
Um, a bit of a later day, I'll probably do a live stream later. But yeah, I've got this trophy, guys. Um, I didn't do a speech. Um, I'm not good with speeches, so I didn't. Yeah, but, so yeah, that is my trophy. It was just a great day in general, Sunday, because I got this trophy. We partied as a team, we had a, a lunch together as a team. It's about 26 of us. One of my teammates couldn't be there um, because of a family thing, but most of us were there at a local restaurant called San Giorgio near or opposite my dad's shop where I'm always getting my fresh trims, as you can see. <laughs> um, and yeah, we had a great meal together, like banter as a team, as we all, always do. It was like the end of season, like, party where you give out all the trophies. So yeah, we had the top goal scorer, the players player, the managers player. Um, and then we went to the pub down the road to the Bohemia and got drunk. And it's great when that happens because you just see the real, not the real side of people, but you know, it, everything's more fun to some level. I didn't drink that much myself. To be honest, I didn't feel well that day, to be honest. I ate it well. I just had a really bad stomach. I don't know. Um, you know me, I'm always got, there's always something in there. There's always something, be it a cold or whatever. Um, but yeah, so I couldn't drink that much or eat that much, but I was all right. I was all right because in good company. Um, sadly, one of our teammates is moving on to my ex-team, um, but great for him because it's a great opportunity um, to progress as a player and come on leaps and bounds tactically like I did. Um, he was our best, not our best player, but one of our key players last season and the seasons I've, since I've been there. Um, he really when we lost players in the past, before I joined, they lost another player, and he joined and he saved the team, really. And he's a really ambitious player, so good luck, Tom, in your future at your, your new team. And I know one day you will, you may be back, you, you know, always a mate, good mate to us. Um, but yeah, new challenges await next season. We've got two new players, Shay and Dan, um, a lot younger than most of us a lot. We're old men compared to them. Um, but they're eager to learn and they, they, they ha haven't had to go through the old style of play where we used to dribble the ball and not pass and it was less entertaining with the old, older chairs we used to use um, but these chairs now they're a lot you know they're a lot more suited to passing the passing game you know and less dribbling is involved so these players have grown up have grown up with this new style of play they're the modern patch of football player if you like so we're we're going to have a lot of fun teaching them and it's going to be great to have two new players in the team. We've already got enough players, but the more the merrier, I say. Um, and it's going to be a great next year. I can't wait. I made so many videos about Project Football. Um, at the end of this, I might leave a little highlight reel of some of the Project Football vlogs over the season. But yeah, it was just one big family, innit? And I got to show them my local pub on Sunday, the Bohemia, down my ends, innit, fam? <laughs> getting all cockney on you, or gangster. Um, <laughs> that's terrible. Cut that. Just cut that bit out. Just, mate, just... All right, I'm gonna go do a live stream, gonna eat some lunch, and edit my previous vlog, guys. Um, I thank you so much, and I'll see you real soon. Good evening, good day, good night. I've said that already, but thank you guys, thank you to all of you, new and old subscribers. Do drop a like, uh, say hello, you know. I'll see you next time. This is vlog 49. Bloody hell, we're almost at 50. <laughs> Midlife crisis. Take it easy, fam. Goodbye. In my 10 years of playing, I've made a lot of mistakes and had a lot of great success. But what I've come to learn is that it's a game of inches, a bit like life, you know. If you're an inch too late, you miss a chance. If you're an inch too early, you still miss a chance. So, much like Pouchier football, and in life, it's all about inches.